Hi, this is Sarah Longfield with jamplay.com, and I'm going to be talking to you about a tapping exercise I used to warm up. Um, so for this first one, it's at 160 BPM, and I like to, it, it starts out slow, and I like to build it up to, to get faster so that I can, like, work my fingers so they're not tripping up over the fretboard. Um, it's 4-4 four, four for the first four bars with dotted quarter notes, and it's going to sound something like... So just really simple, like I break it down to like the very basic tapping stuff and I'm using my, I'm hitting the high E on the 12th fret with my ring finger and then the 12th fret of the high of the B string with my middle finger and then the 12th fret of the G string with my first finger and I'm just going. So the count for that with the click is going to sound like... And for the second bar, we're going to be playing in 3-4 four for four bars, and it's going to be five dotted eighth notes. That sounds something like this. So for that one, I'm basically using the same sort of like, these three are my main three tapping fingers. So for this one, when I'm going the, you're gonna be using your middle finger and your pointer finger on your left hand to hit the seventh fret on the B string and the seventh fret on the G string. So pretty straightforward and simple. Counting the five is a little weird, but that's why I keep it in the exercise because it helps me like think out of that like typical four, four, eighth note box. You know what I mean? Um, so for me, how I count that is I just like, I try to like make sure I land on the one, like counting the like subdivisions, I haven't even thought about that. So it's just like one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five. The next part, um, it gets a little bit more typical, it goes back to four, four, and I'm gonna be playing uh, triplet eighth notes for that. And it sounds like, And for that, you'll notice like as the exercise progresses, it moves down the fretboard. So like I'm starting with just a few strings and then I'm adding more strings, more notes, and I keep moving down and getting a little bit faster, which is why I think it's a good warm up. Um, so that's gonna sound like this. For the last part, we're going to be playing four bars of 4-4 four, four with 16th notes. It sounds like this. And so you're still only using these two fingers on your left hand, which keeps things simple, and you're still staying just on the 7th fret. So, again, slower. Then with the click up to speed, it sounds like this. So that's all the parts. Let's try putting them together. Let's try that slow first at a tempo of 120. Now let's play it a little bit faster. So this is a great exercise to use if you're trying to practice your tapping, and I'll see you at the next lesson.